welcome back to Jill's Comfort Zone. I hope you guys have been enjoying my videos thus far. I have been enjoying myself making them for you. So tonight, what I am making, and just in time for the holidays, huh? Thanksgiving is around the corner. So tonight I am making some collard greens, uh, kale and collard greens with some smoked turkey tail. So I'm going to rinse these babies off and sometimes they have like the um, feather, the little things from the feather. So we're going to pluck those off. I'm going to rinse those off. And all of what I'm doing tonight, we're making it in, guess what? Mm -hmm. In my pressure cooker. So today, I am going to be over here. I've used this probably twice or three times so far I think because I made greens in here before I did some oxtails in here um, already so I have really been using my instant pot I love it love it love it I saute in there sauteed in there and everything so my greens have been cleaned and washed and so um, washed off like I said I'm about to clean the turkey tails what I'm putting in here tonight is going to be some herb de, de Provence, some garlic powder, onion powder, a little salt, smoked paprika, Cajun seasoning, um, red pepper flakes, peppercorn bentley, a little turmeric, some fennel, ground fennel. Um, I have the fennel seeds, but uh, you know, I'm going to grind it up. And then some chicken bouillon. So that is all that I will be putting in here. Um, you put in a little, probably like two cups of water in here. I'll probably put a little less. Don't know. I'll eyeball it because this is not a lot of green. So um, it looked like a lot, but it's going to cook down real quick. So there you have it. I am going to season my greens afterwards. Always, always. So I can pull in that flavor and then let it soak in because um, it goes away. To me, I feel like it goes away. Um, after you cook it anyway so all right so stay tuned I'll be right back to show you how we get this instant pot started and rolling it take about 45 minutes in this pressure cooker um, to cook so this instant pot is the bomb I got mine from Amazon as well and so it is really bomb when I say your greens come out so tender and kicking Oh my God, and these turkey tails falling, mm, they're like so tender. They are truly delicious. So stay tuned and I'll be back to set this all up. Hey guys, welcome back. So I'm gonna add about two cups. Probably put a little bit too much, but it'll be alright. Turkey cells have been cleaned in the what you call it, Jazzy? <laughs> quill. quill. The quills have been plucked. It was hard too, guys. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it was it was tough. Uh, I know I said that I did not want to put any, I'm not using that <laughs> anyway, like for a cleaner. But I know I said I wasn't going to put any um, seasoning in here yet until it's in. But I, I'm cooking that. So I want to add a little bit of crushed peppers to the water so that they can, you know, soften up and give it a little nice little heat to it. And I also want to just put just a little bit of salt. Just a little bit just like that and so now I'm gonna add my greens in here but before I do that I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil extra virgin olive oil in here as well to the bottom of that all right and then now I'm just going to start Placing, oops, leave. Placing my greens, which have been cleaned and 
all that good stuff. I'm gonna squish them down in this pot really nicely. It's gonna do wonders. It's gonna be good. I want all my greens in here. So, so you got collards and kale, right? Getting that all up in this pot here. So what you want to do is make sure everything is locked. There we go. Thank you. Okay. Let me dry my hands real quick. All right, so then we're gonna look down here. So we wanna set the instant pot. So you're gonna set this to pressure cooker. And we're gonna put these, <clears throat> set this and put this. <clears throat> we're gonna change this to, we're gonna cook this for 45 minutes. Okay, and so once that's done, and I got it on 45 minutes, pressure cook high, and what is it? Delay off? No, I don't want that. And I'm just going to hit start. Oh, so I forgot to tell you, you want to make sure everything is in place, you know? locked and this is down in there so as this go on it's going to heat up as you see and so preheating mode is going on here so all that can get started and as i told you i am going to um season the greens after it comes on so it's on there it's flowing and it's going good so I'll be back in 45 minutes, I guess. Guys, don't forget to like, share, and comment down below. And hit that little bell where it's after you subscribe. Um, hit that little bell so you can be notified for when I'm coming to more delicious meals from my home to your home. So, um, always a pleasure to have you here. So, I want to thank you too. Facebook and Instagram for watching me and staying tuned for me making wonderful dishes coming from me to you. So when while this cooking, while this is cooking, um, I am going to go ahead and season, well clean, I'm making chicken wings. So I'm doing fried and barbecue wings along with this. I haven't decided yet, but I think I'm going to make baked macaroni and cheese and some other good stuff so I haven't decided I'm still in a little breeze mode here so I'll be right back stay tuned hey guys just peeking in oh my goodness with 34 minutes left it is smelling delish in here already. My, my, my. So as you can see, it's cooking now. So, <coughs> excuse me. We have approximately like 34 minutes left. Not approximately, but 34 minutes left until these greens are ready. Who's ready for some greens? Me, me, me. And we will be back shortly. Hey, welcome back. <laughs> so our greens should be done. I know they're done. So what I'm going to do now is, you can even do it the slow way. I don't have time. I'm tired. I'm ready to go to bed. <laughs> so... I'm going to do it the fast way release, which I'm always scared of, but I'm going to do this. We're going to pop this, baby. Wait. 
Well, it's supposed to be like this, right? Have it been already? All right, well, look, here we go. Ain't nothing but to do it. I'm about to open this up. <laughs> Uh-oh. Ooh. Okay. So I guess I was in here ODing, huh? Just... It's doing. They done. They done. Look how much that done shrink down in there, guys. Let me see one of these turkey tails. This is done. This is done. Look, turkey tails is good. Look, falling apart. I can't even pull it up. Yes. Yes. Oh, they're done. This is delicious. I guess I have 45 minutes. Oh, it smells so good. Without the seasoning, guys. All I added was in some water. All, um, olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, and some red pepper flakes. It smells so delish. So now it's time for seasoning. I already told y'all what I'm putting in here. I will say about a tablespoon of each. You know I go heavy with the garlic, so. Yeah. Garlic is my friend. I love garlic. Probably a table tablespoon. But I think I put a teaspoon, sorry, a teaspoon of each in here. Or so. <laughs> you know? Smoked paprika. I don't know. Be so thick with this smoked paprika. I ain't got time to be shaking. And you don't need much of this anyway because we got our smoked turkey tails in here. So I don't need to be doing too much with that paprika. Yeah, guys. So greens are done. And I'm going to taste these babies, but in another video, I'll show you how we, what we have with these. This is greens from, don't know how I'm going to feel tomorrow, so, after church. So, I said, let me do this now and get this all together here this is the ground fennel all right and I'm gonna stir these babies up then I'll give it I'll just toss it up in here as you see I didn't add any salt yet I did put a little salt in here earlier oh smells so good like I said it's all cooking up really nicely mm. yes baby yes so this is for tomorrow this part is out and I don't have to worry about this I'll be right back let me go grab me a dish and taste these lovely babies before I add salt. So stay tuned. Uh, so, put me a little bit in here, see? All right, you can see it? So, put me a little bit in here. Greens, give me a little turkey, smoked turkey tails on here. Hot. I guess this stopped a long while, <laughs> but it's it, the cool thing is it's when it the instant pot cut off, 
it goes to warm, so it's not still cooking. So it keeps it warm. Mm. Tasting it without the salt. And you know what? I can eat it like this, but I do want a little bit more salt. So, here you have it. Collard greens in 45 minutes with some smoked turkey tails. Yum, yum, yum. Stay tuned for Jill's Comfort Zone. Dot com. This recipe will be on the website. I am working hard, 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 guys, trying to get this website up. There's so many components. Learning where um, WordPress and Elementor and all that good stuff. It has really been a challenge, but I'm pushing my way through. I didn't start it over um, since the last time we spoke about creating this dish I mean this dish <laughs> this site and so I've been really working hard it's really a tough job so stay tuned for this collard greens and kale mixture with smoked turkey tails coming on there to you the full recipe and don't forget please subscribe to my channel Hit that belly thing down there so that you can stay tuned on my latest and new dishes. Um, also, don't forget to like, share, and comment down below and let me know what you think about this video. So I am going to add probably like about a teaspoon or so of some sea salt, um, you know, because that goes well. I believe sea salt is good when you dishes are cooked already so I am gonna add this to this dish so the full recipe like I said will be coming to you soon so like I always say that I love you stay blessed and peace out until next time Jill's comfort zone from my home to yours have a good night